I got to ask you about the latest numbers from the TSA. Just 500,000 people screened yesterday. Uh, there is a concern, a, a, a serious concern within the industry that we're starting to see the slowdown and people are going to say, that's it. I'm just not going to fly right now. Give me your take on, on business right now. Well, first of all, thanks for having me, Phil. Good to, uh, good to be with you. Uh, the virus is our top concern, not just for our industry, but for our nation. And while our people are doing a great job of providing a safe travel experience for our customers, including blocking all middle seats through the end of March, uh, enforcing masks, making certain that every, every experience is, is clean before we take off, uh, the, the uh, virus is having an impact. Uh, customers are heeding the warnings of government authorities. Uh, the CDC uh, warnings have been important in that regard. Quarantine, stay-at-home restrictions you continue to see are out there. So I would expect that the travel we're going to be seeing for the upcoming Christmas period is going to be similar to what we've experienced over the last few weeks. We're currently at about one-third of normal traffic trends, and I don't see that changing here for the next couple of months. So that's the challenge. The good news is that with the vaccine on the horizon, uh, spring we know there's enormous pent-up demand. People are waiting to get back out again. And there's a promise that by, by March, uh, April, May, in that time frame, tens of millions of Americans will have been vaccinated and ready to get on with their lives. And that's what we're looking forward to. And the passenger levels are, are right now somewhere between, let's say, 63 and 70 percent, somewhere in that range, depending on the day of the week. Is that where you expect it to stay leading up to uh, the Christmas holidays, end of the year holidays, and then in the first quarter when we know that it's always the slowest for the airlines? Or does it get even weaker? Do you see a drop down where we see passenger levels down 70, 75 percent? Well, we're in a period of the month of December. Is, it's really two, two parts of the month. The first half of December traditionally is a very slow travel period, even in normal times. And we're seeing that with the, uh, with the current month as well. Uh, once we get through the middle part of the month, we do expect to see traffic uh, increase. Though, again, I, I'm not sure it's going to increase more than maybe a third of what it was a year ago. And then January should probably be another slow uh, travel month. We've raised the cash at Delta. We have over $17 billion in the bank. Uh, we'll get through these next few months. And I'm quite optimistic that by the time we get to the spring, we're going to be looking at a real resurgence of demand. People are ready to get back with their lives. Shepard Smith here. Thanks for watching CNBC on YouTube.